It sold in three days for $55 plus shipping. Welcome back, and if this is your first time watching, my name is Brandon, and I sell men's clothing on eBay. This is day 16 of the What Sold series, where I show you my daily eBay sales. At the end of the video, I'll dive into the numbers, but for now, let's jump straight into those sales. The first sale of the day was actually the best sale of the day. It was this H Bar C Western shirt. It sold in three days for $55 plus shipping. You want to find the ones that have the embroidery and these pockets on the front. I'll give you guys a great keyword to actually include in your title. It's smile pocket. That's what they refer to these pockets as. And it's going to make it sell quicker and for more money. Sale number two was this Rain Spooner Hawaiian shirt. It sold in one day for a best offer of $13 plus shipping. It was in a bad size, size small, but it was also altered. The sleeves were hemmed and uh, the bottom was also hemmed. So I was just happy to move it quickly. Sale number three was this Lululemon long sleeve polo shirt. It sold in one week for full price $30 plus shipping. Sale number four was this Fox Racing button up. It took two weeks to sell and it sold for full price of $22 plus shipping. Most Fox Racing stuff does pretty good. You just need to buy it at a low enough cost that you can sell it for a pretty reasonable price because none of their stuff really goes for crazy money, but you can sell it quickly at the right price. Sale number five was a Patagonia sweatshirt. It wasn't a size small and it still sold in three days for full price of $25 plus shipping. Sale number six was a Chaps Ralph Lauren Hawaiian shirt. It took about six months to sell and it sold for a best offer of $5 plus shipping. It does, ha it does have a bunch of yellowing and spots on the front of it, so I was happy to take any offer. Sale number seven was one of those lightweight Polo Ralph Lauren hoodies. This one did have the Polo Bear on the front of it. It took five days to sell and it sold for full price $25 plus shipping. It did have some holes and wear in it and it still sold for that price. Sale number eight was an Irma Gildo Zania Sport quarter zip. It took a month and a half to sell and it sold for a best offer of $37 plus shipping. This one was just a cotton one, but it did have like a velour uh, feel to it. So these, these can generally do pretty well. They also can be made in other materials like cashmere or wool, and those also sell really well. The ninth and final sale of the day was a Wrangler Western shirt. It was a pearl snap and it was very colorful. And it was also a bit of the thicker cotton. Those are usually the ones that you wanna look for compared to the thinner ones. Anyways, this one sold in four days for full price of $45 plus shipping. Now let's go ahead and jump into those numbers. Just like yesterday, it looks like eBay is still having some issues with pulling up the data for the sales. So I just went ahead and made some of my own data and I will pull it in for you guys. Let's just jump right into it. On September 16th, we sold nine items for a total gross sales of $336.99, giving us an average sale price of $37.44. We need to remove the taxes and fees collected and paid by eBay, which was $22.33. We also need to remove our total selling fees. These include both our eBay final value fees, our cost of our shipping labels, and our cost of our promoted listing sales. Only two of my items from today uh, sold via promoted listing, and I paid a total of $5.71 for those two sales, which like I said, I'm always happy to pay that extra fee just to get a few extra sales. Uh, we do need to also take out our cost of goods, which is an average of $10.55 per item. After we take all that away, that gives us a net profit for the day of $86.86. Not the best day, but still better than nothing, so I'll take it. That's all I have for you guys today. Thanks for watching. I'll see you tomorrow for day 17 of the What Sold series. Peace.